Oh, hi. It's Rob. Uh, I'm in the office. Well, the, the mom office. Uh, it's Monday as I'm recording this Monday evening. Got mom's bed today. Her, uh, her hospital bed. It's not really a hospital bed. It's going to be uh, the low end version of that, but it's, you know, it's got the thing where it raises up at the head and it can go up and down. A little thing with the feet where it can raise up the knees. Although mom's kind of short. I don't know if that is going to be her knees or her ankles. Uh, we got that in, you know, got the, I got the old bed out and wow. <laughs> I forgot how much mattresses weigh. Uh, her mattress is in really good shape. Um, it's a Sealy Posturepedic and it's, I mean, it's not sagging or anything. Uh, probably going to be setting that up down in the living room here uh, in case I get visitors and they can have a place to crash out. Um, uh, let's see. I am going to be coming down to the cities. Uh, I'm going to be leaving Wednesday morning as quickly as I can, which is probably looking like it's going to be 10-ish, maybe a little later because Sue won't be able to be here until then. Um, I will be staying down there, coming back Sunday, unless something happens. I'm pretty full up at this point. I've got uh, things I need to do Wednesday evening when I get down there. Uh, Thursday, I need to go to work. I need to do a bunch of errands where I have to sign papers and all sorts of things. I have to harvest the garden. I have to move a bunch of tools. I have to get keys made. I have to get the snow blower running. It's, yeah, I'm going to work when I'm down there. Uh, I'm not going to have a lot of time to be social. Um, I, I, I don't know. I'm going to try and sleep when I'm down there. It's, it's this elusive thing. Um, I am sleep deprived sleep depraved um ba -ba -ba. let's see got the dog fence um reinforced or enhanced i guess today so uh, when the dogs come down they will be you know they're they will be contained in a you know small space it's not it's not intended for big dog exercise they have a little bit of room to romp around and and we can play a little bit but it's mostly for being able to go to the bathroom um it reminds me of things that I need to get. Um, I am going to be bringing a few things back. There are, I've been doing triage of, you know, it's like, well, here's what, here's what I would like to bring back. And then going, well, I don't have room for all of this, so what can I leave behind? And it's getting to a list that's, I think I can fit all that in the car on the way back and still have the dogs be relatively comfortable. One of the things I need to bring back is the trailer hitch and the uh, the kit so that I can try and put that on while I'm up here. Um, bringing back some tools, not all of them. Uh, the ones that I know that I will need when I'm here. Um, goodness, let's see what else. Um, I have to make up a bunch of meals in advance for mom because Sue Sue's not a cook. Uh, so if I make up a bunch of meals in advance or a bunch of individual things in advance, she can at least, you know, have them ready to go so that you can just pop it in the microwave. It's not ideal, but you know, it's what I can do. Fixed a bunch of stuff, um, added some lights in the kitchen. I'm going to be adding some more, uh, under counter lights. I put one up over the stove. So I'm going to be doing a fix it video up here. Uh, I, mom's, the stove in the basement has one element that isn't working and it's a, it's one of those sealed range tops, the glass top with the heaters inside it. So I'm going to be fixing one of them. Uh, let's see. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, ba -ba -bum. getting mom's bed in today was epic. Uh, I had to move a whole bunch of stuff that has been piled 
in the hallways and uh, a bunch of stuff out of her room to make room to get the bed in and just I cleaned out part of the garage so that they could bring it in turns out I didn't need to because they bring it in pieces and assemble it uh, so but I got that done and it means that I'm I'm a step ahead which is good uh, cleaned a little bit more of mom's kitchen the it's actually starting to become a functional kitchen almost and it's noticeable did a little bit of mopping sweeping uh, a little bit of cleaning up uh, some friends came over and did uh, vacuuming i got some help with a dog fence so it's now a little bit more robust than it was which is good uh, I have a bunch of stuff I need to do tomorrow. It's going to be packing a lot in. I'm trying to plan for it tonight, uh, making a list of numbers for Sue to call in case something goes wrong. Uh, it's, you know, there, there are things that we've kind of got a routine going that is okay. You know, things that are mama's mama's doing. Uh, that she wants to do and big thing I have to do tomorrow is going to be cooking um, I'm going to be cooking a lot of stuff up in a little more bulk you know it's like make a bunch of pancakes in advance uh, make some scrambled eggs in advance make a bunch of spaghetti noodles in advance uh, some browned hamburger with you know and ketchup mixed in uh, I got some you know, salt-free ketchup. Salt-free ketchup. Ugh. Um, boy, uh, there's. I'm sure I'm missing something. Uh, my mind is crammed so full of stuff. Uh, but it's going okay. I'm going to be up here for a while. I'm planning. I got to try and plan to do all this stuff. And the trailer, I want to bring the trailer hitch up because if I can install it here, then when I go back down, I can use the trailer to bring stuff and still have the dogs. Mm. I don't know. It's going to be, it's going to be a lot. That's, uh, I can make it through this. I can do this. <laughs> um, there are people that are willing to help. More than anything, I'm going to need emotional support and just... reminding me that I have friends out there because... Boy, there's nobody here. Uh, you know, there's mom's friends. Uh, here's Kyle and Michelle, but I haven't seen them. Uh, I, you know, it's, I'm getting to know the I'm getting to know the people at Ace Hardware really well. They recognize me now. Um, the Office Depot guys recognize me, and it's kind of funny because every time I go in there, something goes wrong with their cash register. It's like I'm cursed. Um. trying to talk mom into letting me get a snowblower because the guy that she's got isn't going to plow the places I need plowed and it's you know she's like well we'll talk about it later it's like let's talk about it before the snow flies <sighs> I don't know I can fix the stove that way we don't need to get a new stove for the basement. Um, stoves are expensive. Wow. The... Well, I drove her car today. At least a little bit. Um, it's a little loud. I think the exhaust system probably needs a little bit of, uh, a little bit of TLC. Mm. I don't know what else. I'm still kind of going 
full throttle. Uh, there's a lot of a lot of going full speed and then forgetting what I'm doing. <laughs> so I have like three things going on at once. And it's like I'll do one thing and then I'll go into the room and it's like, oh yeah, I haven't done that yet. So I'll do that for a while and then I'll walk back and oh yeah, I haven't done that yet. But slowly but surely, this is coming together. Um, I have a place. I have a place of my own here. My own being a, you know, I'm the only one here. Mom doesn't come downstairs. You know, she really can't anymore. And I'm taking care of the place. I'm fixing up stuff that needs fixing. Um, taking care of mom. Trying to, <laughs> trying to help her when things go awry. <laughs> There are some times when there are conflicts. It's like I'm starting to go cook in the kitchen and she'll say, Rob, Rob. And I'll go, what? She, I go back and talk to her and she goes, are you going to go cook in the kitchen? Yes, that's what I was doing. So that kind of stuff happens more often than is even funny. Uh, I'm looking forward to going home for a, little, for a few days. I know it's temporary. Um, I'm going to miss home, but mm, I, I don't know what all I'm going to need to do. I've got the snow blowing figured out, snow removal. Um, I keep paying the bills. Uh, I mean, I don't know what all else is going to be. I don't know what is going to happen. Uh, I'm going to do the best I can in advance, but I know that there's some stuff that's going to come up that I don't, I haven't prepared for. Um, so, yeah. Tomorrow's a busy day. I'm probably not going to bring the camera back when I go, uh, just for space. Uh, if I need to record something, I'll probably record on my phone. That seems to work okay. Uh, in the meantime, peace.